then we bring the cows in, get them milk by 6 a.m. So all You're listening to on. This Morning's Farmer. <laughs> Go on, you were talking about cow bringing in. Yeah, we bring them in from milking, and then all that can go... Pop the straight jackets on them? <laughs> what? Thanks very much for being this morning's farmer, Robert Moon. <laughs> Robert, uh, did you have your breakfast this morning? Well, I, I reckon C the way things... Can you just bright. answer yes for the purposes of a joke? <laughs> yes. In which case, you must be a full moon. <laughs> Hello? I'm still here. Yeah, I was uh, making a pun on your name. All right. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for being this morning's farmer. <laughs> so, uh, Robert, a bit slow on the uptake there. Uh, don't know what he had for breakfast. Presumably an infected spinal column in a bat. <laughs> Just making a quick joke there about how infected cattle feed can attack the central nervous system. It's just come up to 5.35 a.m. Kommen Sie bitte und listen to craft work. <laughs> Let's get back to Cockadoodle Who. Cockadoodle Who. <laughs> and I asked who invented the skip. Jack on line two. Good morning, Alan. Good uh, morning. Look, I just wanted to uh, say your comments earlier about farmers was ignorant and offensive. Who invented the skip? I don't care who invented the skit. I think it's way out who of order. Who invented the skit? You, you speak like a man who has no who knowledge of the, the skit? subject that you're talking about. Who invented right? the skit? I don't know who invented the bloody skit. Bobby Moore, I don't bloody know, do I? Yeah, I'm just on. sick and tired of you slagging farmers off. Are you going to apologise to them all on your show, are you? Are you going to Come on, I mean, you must know some of the rotten rubbish you produce. I mean... Tongue, for example. Who eats tongue, for goodness sake? Imagine a tongue sticking out of a sesame seed cob. Listen, you made these comments without any real knowledge about the pressures that we're under. I just didn't find it very funny, that's all. Well, I wouldn't eat one of your tomatoes if it came up and said, eat me, oh. which is not unlikely, Listen. considering all the rubbish you stick in them. You ignorant shit. <laughs> Caroline, line four, hello. Hello, Alan. Hello. Hello, yeah, have you got a brain, or is your head just full of shit? <laughs> OK, Mike from Polgrave, are you there, sir? Oh, 